Hi, my name is Mathis. I'm 17 years old and I'm a cardist from Germany. In this tutorial I will explain my move Emiratev. It's a 6 packet one handed cut with 4 packets and 2 single cards. It's a hard move, but I hope I can help you with this video. should be big, not too big, so it should still be uh, small enough to spin it around properly, but uh, it should have enough cards for the rest of the flourish. The second uh, packet you split off should be less cards. I use around 5 cards normally, because you will hold the packet here in this weird position and if you have too many cards it will be harder to hold the packet and if you have just like one card it will be hard to hold the other packet that will fall onto that packet later so i take around five cards for that packet so split off a bigger packet and split off small packet Turn the judo of the packet until here, then contact your ring finger with the packet, let go with the middle finger and just push it upwards with the index and middle finger. Now riffle off 
some of the cards here with the thumb. Then take one card with your index finger, move it around. And while you're moving this packet around, you can let this packet fall down here whenever you want. But I like it if it is in the same uh, movement. If you're here, you want to clip this packet between the index and thumb. And then you want to move around another card with your middle finger. You will move that upwards and maybe this thing right here now will be hard for you. I don't know. Because you have to move it like this. It comes from here, moves upwards and you have to move it like this. You will just do this uh, by using the moment on your middle and middle finger and thumb. And you will just move this a bit so the card will turn around. Let me show you again. You open up, split off the other packet, contact the ring finger, split off the packet here, but don't let it fall yet. Turn around one card. Now you let fall this packet, you clip this card here. And now you move this card around and all in one motion you let it fall on this packet here. Now this could be a hard part too. When you have this card clipped, now you want to move your index finger up and take the card with the index finger. So you take that card upwards again. And if this card does not fall in here properly, that's not a problem because now you're moving the thumb away and this will fall in there better. And you, you uh, moving the thumb away because you want to turn around that card. Using your thumb and index finger, you want that card to turn around so you can um, put that card over here. And now when you are in this position, you just want to close it like this. So you have this packet here, and you hold this in this weird grip. Now you just move this packet in that direction using your pinky finger. And these two packets uh, will square up and now you still have this packet uh, over here clipped between the pinky and the ring finger so when you turn that packet down these cards will move out you might have problems that they don't fall out so try to practice that that you can move it out and le then let it also fall onto the other cards Again, open up this, contact the ring finger, split off the packet, get one card around, clip the card, also let this packet fall down. You can also use uh, this packet to let it fall down, like this. I don't know if you see it, I think so. Now get the other card around. I also um, should say that I first push it upwards a bit, and then we grip with the middle finger a bit so I can get uh, better under the card like this and close that like this and now you want this packet to move here like this again and you have it on your pinky finger and can just close it up and that was my tutorial for Emratev uh, I hope you had fun. I hope you can learn this move. It's a really hard move. And if you have still any questions, you can just uh, DM me on Instagram and I try to answer that and try to help you. But it is still a really hard move. So good luck. Thanks for watching this tutorial. And bye. See you next time.